You can check out Global Warming's Coming Fast by Peter Tracy Live on YouTube in the link in the description. And a book about a vacation gone oh so well in a Kindle edition for just 99 cents, also in the link in the description. Hello everybody, my name is Oliver Leopold. I'm actually a little bit sick today, and that's kind of why I don't really want to shoot a normal video with my face. So, what's the next best thing? What's on my phone? And if you didn't know, I do a daily vlog. Make sure you check out the description. I'll actually vlog right now. Let's get right into it. So, this is the LG G Flex Sprint Edition. Um, it's 32 gigabytes. There's my umbrella. Um, and it's a really nice, really big phone. And all of the things on my phone complement it oh so well. So why am I on LTE in my house? It's because I have unlimited data, which just costs around $15 more than a normal plan. I have no idea what this wallpaper is, but it's really nice and it moves as you move the phone. Then I have Nova Launcher here, which is a lot better than the default LG launcher and you can get some really nice Android L transitions and it has a lot of settings to customize your experience very largely. Okay then at the front I have Meerkat and I don't use it that much but I want to get farther into it so Meerkat just came out for Android so I wanted to give it a shot. Then I have the Starbucks app which I use regularly when I go to Starbucks so I can pay for my objects and I can get rewards for them. Then using this I have the Silhouette Icon Pack. And it's really easy to change icons. You would just go into Edit, click on the um, logo, and then you can select the theme being Silhouette, what it thinks you should have, and then a bunch of different apps that you can choose from. So this is the Instagram app, Twitter app, both of them are at Oliver underscore Leopold. My calling app, which has some really big keys. I don't know why it's doing that, but it has some really big keys usually. Then I don't know why I picked this logo, but this is Vine, and I honestly don't use Vine that much. Um, three notifications. Great, but I don't use Vine that much, so I just have it there to fill up space. I have my Gmail app, which I use with both my Gmail accounts. Snapchat, um, you can add me. Ready? If you don't, if you can't do it, it's at Oliver underscore Leopold. I will actually put it, put something on right now. Shooting a video. Shooting a video, exclamation point. And put that up on my story. Okay, so moving along, I have obviously my settings, which I can also access by pressing those two buttons. Not very important, but I also like the icon for it. And then the Play Store, which I like just randomly browsing at sometimes. Then this is a remote. And what does the remote do? It literally just turns off my phone. Then I can double tap and enter my password. Next up, I have a Messages app. I use Textra. And sorry, you can't see what it looks like. But let's say I want to make a new one to me. Z, 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 and then just type in something. It will then send, and it looks really nice. Yeah, I know it failed. Next up, obviously, I have my app drawer, and we'll get into that. YouTube, and then this is, I actually, oh, this 
This is not going to tell me what it's called, but I like using this if I want to search for an app like Amazon, and then I can just go right into it. And on here I have my calendar widget with no padding so it reaches, no, ugh, so it reaches all the corners and you can change that by just doing padding, clicking it to turn on, and then pressing resize and pulling it all the way. There. No. And then I have my YouTube Studio app, NPR One, Play Music. I have Fiverr because I do a lot of things on that. Sigfig, which I can use for managing my stocks. My camera, which it's not the best camera um, because the display's not that good, but it's an okay camera otherwise. Then I have Coinbase, which I use for Bitcoin. Like 14 cents in there, and that's kind of it. I need to fix that, but that's kind of it for there. And then I have some, I have a flashlight, um, which is like the normal flashlight, the first one that comes up on the Play Store. I just edited the icon and the title. I have 94%, which is a game, some Android Wear stuff, Adventure Capitalist, um, some more games. Oh, it's a called App Dialer. I have Barcode Scanner for. I actually don't know why I have that anymore. It used to be required, but now it's not. Okay, so then I have Buffer, I have a calculator, Cam Card is really nice when I get so many business cards, Cash for sending people money and receiving money myself, um, Ingress, which is a really fun game, and then I also have some just Sprint and LG default applications, screen off config, which was the little remote icon, square, register, screen dimmer, which activates at night so the screen goes below the lowest that's available, some sprint things like sprint zone, which I actually use a lot. I have tasker and twitch, which also I don't ever use, uh, and then I also have pretty much the same things and then I have Zeit which I use sometimes for reading news, ZigZag which is a game sometimes I play, more wear apps and Vine without the weird logo. So that was not not how it started. It was like this probably. Okay, so that's what was on my LG G Flex. Thank you so much for watching this video. Give it a like if you liked it. Give it a dislike if you disliked it. Um, hopefully I'm feeling better on Tuesday and I'll show you my face. And I won't be talking so weird. So thank you for watching. I will see you in the next video. If you're not subscribed, make sure you subscribe. I make a video every Tuesday and Saturday. Uh, here are my most recent uploads. Thank you so much for watching and bye.